My name's Charlie Winger. I'm from uh, Joliet, Montana. Been here 52 years. Well, when I first started, we lived in a truck for two or three years. And uh, I built a trailer that was my studio trailer. And so we got hot. We'd go north, got cold, we went south, you know, and it was, uh, I had a, quite a good time with that. I'm a collector and needed something else. So my parents had a place in Red Lodge and we moved in to, in the winter of 70. It snowed like crazy and everything else. And so we decided we went out of here. We loaded everything up. About 30 miles down the road, so four side sale side in the junkyard. Been here, been here 52 years now. <laughs> uh, I practiced quite a few styles of work. Probably a half a dozen or so. And uh, I'm known mostly for my kinetic work and I do all different shape sizes of that. My early work were little figures that I built with an aircraft torch, little pieces of metal and dropping a time off a welding rod. And, uh, they were a little whimsical too, so that's another style. I, I'd actually uh, like not being influenced by society in general as much as possible and it uh, forces me to be creative. And, Cause if you aren't, nobody else is gonna do it for you. And uh, it really helps in the long run uh, on the creative process, especially when you're self-taught. Basically it's learned by pain, you know, you screw something up, you figure out why you did it and, and fix it, you know, and nobody's looking at you, laughing at you, pointing at you, and all that kind of thing. So you just do it. You know, there's probably negatives to that. Yes, and uh, exposure for your art and other things, but to me, it's my lifestyle is the most important thing. I always say my real art is my lifestyle and everything else is a byproduct.